<laughs> but anyway, speaking of contradictions, can you explain to me why this is a thing? Why, why? Why am I watching this? Why is this? Why? Why is this an issue? Why? Why are we? Why? Why has this got Twitter? And Instagram and the whole social media in a chokehold for the last same day. Why is black you, you you letting you gonna let a nigga walk up and, and hug your girl, pick her up, swing her around, and not address you, not speak to you and you her man? We having fun here or we talking yeah. for real? No, that's we, talking for both. real and have fun. We're we gonna, we, we gonna do both. Okay, so this is oh I'm so, I'm sorry to be the guy, but this is a shorter clip of the the the, the, the what actually happened. He dapped up Jonathan Mazes first. First, okay. You yeah, he yeah. dapped them up first, and then he did that. I mean, still, I don't know if I'm comfortable with that. Even if you dap me up first, yeah, picking up my girl is crazy. That's insane, bro. Like, what? Where do you get the balls enough to like, bro? Like, this nigga must can fight. He must can like whip some ass. Cause like, hold up, <laughs> it's no way you come. Like, I'm not picking up a nigga girl. In front. Like, what type of time you on? No. All right, first of all, his his relationship with Megan goes back. 20 years, bro. They've known mean? each other on a, that yo, makes it worse. a free show. You're right. Thank you. Years. Thank you for telling me that. That, that makes it worse. Make it, worse. it makes it 10 times worse because yeah. y'all got history now. Well, I don't, I, all right, Where's please the help me this, You know what? No, we know what girls want to say and shit. Boundaries what? and shit. And, and what? Like, right. They be using all these he words. Didn't he didn't pick them up and then put our legs around him and go, yeah, baby. Like, yeah, it I mean, was that's, just, I mean, that's uh, for my imagination. The moment you pick my girl up off her feet, now I'm thinking everything. That's what I see. You, yeah, that's, that's what, what I, I see. see. In my mind, oh, oh, that's how you used to fuck you or something? <laughs> Look, it, where's the turnaround? Where's the turnaround? Oh, that's how he used this, to, that's how I used to get, get down? Nah, we're not doing that. Where's the turnaround? Look, it's Look just it. a light low. Oh! I've no, done this gotta, before. Do, yeah, but I, I bet you the niggas. I bet you. I bet you her chick wasn't around, or her nigga wasn't around when you did that, though. You're not oh picking up no God. chick around. Uh, no, you're not doing that, bro. Yo, you're don't piss doing. my girl up off her feet, bro. I don't care. You talking about? Oh, they 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 relationship go back twenty years. Oh my God. Man. man, it can go back to AD. Fuck you talking about? <laughs> she could have been. She could have been dancing you, with Jesus, nigga. <laughs> you're not doing that. Don't pick he, used my kiss, he, used, he used to kiss her back in the day, so now he can kiss her because he used to kiss back in the day and shit. Ain't nobody doing that shit, bro. You're not Yo, hey, Mike, what you bro. say, bro? <laughs> bro? Just because you used to kiss her 20 years ago, don't mean just because you see her now, you you kissing her and then no, nah, we ain't doing none of that shit. And you know them uh, niggas oh. had an argument back. You know them niggas argued. I know about, they right? had an argument, bro. You know they so did. what are you supposed to do? Hey, baby, don't pick me up, or I'm not baby. But hey, guy, don't touch me like that. Or is like, that wrong? Me, uh, like, uh, uh, put this? me down, stop. You can do like a little play for like, uh, put me down, stop. What you doing? Don't be doing like, you know what I mean? Anything. Oh man, you know my man right here. Like, give me, yo. Don't say that because now that sound like when he's not around, you can do that. You can't say that though. Yeah, yeah. And right. I and I want to continue. I want to defend my man's uh, uh, Kane the Conqueror real quick. You know what I'm saying? Because he done already got out of a court case for looking mean and saying things that are borderline mean. So, no, he can't show any emotion. No, he can't go and grab Michael E. Lee and, yo, nigga, put my girl down. He can't do that because he, uh, yo, this nigga got angry justifiably and caught a court case and, and lost that bitch. So, but then also... If, he got to be the white breadest ass nigga on the internet. Go ahead. And if 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 Michael Ely, if you know that, because it was public knowledge, you know what I mean. If you know that as Michael Ely, why are you gonna put this nigga in the? Why are you gonna put your friend in a position to where now she, she might, you know, she she might catch some hands on the way home. You know what I mean? Like why the fuck? Why would you do that? I'm sending you home with an abuser. You know what I mean? Like now, granted though, they they say he only he only do that to to the white women. That's what I don't know. This is all uh, the last shit. Oh yeah, where did this come from? They they say he only that's why because a lot of the uh a lot of black women was in the comments when the shit happened when he was in court. They were talking about we don't care because he shouldn't have been with a white woman. He need to stay within this race type shit. You know that whole dynamic. So I mean that just looked that just looked crazy. Like the long <laughs> hug around the bottom of the waist. Nah. <laughs> nah. The only thing that helps Megan out in this case is that she didn't have two arms around this nigga. It was like, ah, uh, you know, she just 
holding on to her head. So her head. And then you know, it, it's it's just a hell of a time for Jonathan Majors because didn't Megan Good just go on? Uh, I don't know if it was Shannon Sharp and said that like all her friends advised her not to be with uh, Jonathan Majors. It's like, bro, all this should be, mm. all this should happening at once is a lot. It's like. Bro, I wonder where his mind is. Uncomfortable though. He looked mad and uncomfortable in that clip. Can we show that clip one more time, man? This nigga look mad. Oh. You know when a nigga gets to looking around, it's like, all right, look, he looking down in his bag. He ain't pulling nothing out of his bag. Look, he just opened it up. Oh, he put his phone in there. Oh, he getting ready to fight. He had to put his phone up. He getting ready to fight. He had to get both. He took his glasses off. It's game time. Like, all right, all right. Yeah, look, let me go ahead and take these glasses off. So, yeah, he, uh-uh, nah, nah, nah. Be cool, Whoever. John. Davis, man. Just continue to be cool, brother. It's going to change around. Who, who the fuck is this nigga in the background? Yo, wait a minute. Yo, who got the pink scarf joint on? Oh, he That's wild. Yo, he this like nigga got Carmelo Yo, what the hell's going on here, bro? Like, this is this whole scene is wild. Where, where are they? Is this like a premiere or something? It might be a premiere. I don't know. I'm looking at the letters in the back, but I don't, it looks like it. It might spell players. Is that what I'm saying? Oh, no. Hey, hey, I don't know. I don't know where the hell they at. This is super wild, bro. All right. So for the, so just just for the let, let's wrap this segment up by saying I, I first of all, I knew Jay Hill was going to defend the angriness of, of America because this nigga super alpha. Yo, he yo, you can't pass gas in front of his girl. He'd be ready to fight. Like, so, you know, what I'm saying I know he he's. He's gonna wild out. It's summer you know, bro. Last summer respect, bro. Come on, man. It wasn't, it wasn't like he tongue her down or even kissed her so, on the uh, cheek. So or they keep it with you. I'm, I'm gonna keep it funky with you. I think he played it well. Like I'm, I'm, I'm too player to have a problem with that. I get it. But I might say, I might go home like, yo, you don't think that was a little inappropriate? Like that's that's we probably shouldn't do that in in in, in public. You know what I'm saying? And and if she says something like, I'm not about to argue it. I'm all about the response. Like right. If I bring something to you, depending on how you respond, it depending on how we can move forward. If she says, mm -hmm. yeah, I can see, you know, that probably was a little inappropriate. I didn't mean nothing by it. Cool, we good. Now, if you want to say, why are you da, 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 you fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm all about a response. If I bring you something and you respond in a way of like, you know what? I can see that. You know, have some type of accountability, whatever the case may be. I, I wasn't even, I didn't even think he was about to do that. My bad. It, it really was in the moment. Cool. We have mm -hmm. understanding. That's, mm -hmm. but I'm not going to, I'm not going to make a big deal about it anyway. But even still. I'm talking about, we talking about Megan Good, I think. Like, at what point do we just keep our business to ourselves? Like, I'm looking at it when Megan Good says she ignored all her friends who warned her not to date Jonathan Majors. Like, that's like strike two. Yeah, that look crazy it's, on you. Yeah, it's like, bro, like, now you, you got her saying all her friends warned her not to be with him. Cool, I guess because he was in a domestic case. I, get, mm -hmm. I mean, I understand that. But then this come out, it's like, man, you got me on the internet looking crazy. Like that's how I'm looking. Yeah. You got me on. Like, come on, let's let's have a meeting real quick. Let's let's, let's get on one nothing. accord. Yeah, like you feel know I me. Mean? Like it's like I, don't know. I ain't saying nothing. I'm petty. The next chance I get to pick up a bitch, I'm picking it up. As... <laughs> you know that was gonna be my next question. Yeah, that I'm was picking it up and around. Question. And then and I'm gonna you... wait for you. If you say something about, no, nah, you just did that. Like, no, 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 no. Make sure I'm full of shit, bro. He is. No, nah, keep got... that keep that same energy. He the got... next chance I get around your homegirl, I'm picking her up and swinging around. I ain't seen her in a while. Oh my God, it's so good. To, it's so good to see you. Oh my God. Yeah. You cap. I don't believe you. I'm petty, nigga. I will do that. You ain't doing shit. All right. So, all right. My question is: Have you ever picked up a chick and swung her around, whether she had a man or not? Like, is this? I don't feel like that's just not normal. That's some old 1993 shit. Like, I mean, I, I pick up girls, like to hug them. Like, I mean, if I miss, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Not, I nah, nah, outside of a chick that I'm dealing with, oh, that's a good question. I don't think I picked nobody up unless they've like jumped. If they jump, like, and it's like, oh, I gotta catch you, but I'm not, I'm not knowingly picking up no chick and swinging her around, and I'm not, I'm not doing that. Yeah, I mean, you do a lot of meet and greets, and I, I understand you trying to get money like Chris Brown. So I'm thinking that maybe you would be more open to a lot of exotic, uh, uh, you know, entrances and exes on the situation. You feel me? I'm not a sex symbol. You know, Chris Brown is identified as a sex symbol. You know what I mean? I think that also mm. plays a part in it. Um, you know. Maybe that, if, 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 if Michael Ely was ugly, right? Nobody would say shit. Mm. If, if academics picked up Megan Good. 
<laughs> Nobody would be caring about this yeah, shit right niggas now. wouldn't have said a motherfucking word, bro. They wouldn't have said that shit, would bro. Not have been news at all, bro. Yo, yo, that's she crazy. Probably, she that's... probably wouldn't have let him. He probably tried to give up, pick up. <laughs> what you doing? Put me down. Uh-uh. Oh, uh-uh. What's going on? Nah, nah that's facts, though. That's, facts. that's definitely what. That's crazy problem. how like we look at things depending on the attractiveness of the, of the person. Yeah. Hey, my girl can have the most hey. ugly. Any homeboy you want to have, hey, if he ugly, he could be a homeboy. Once that nigga, uh, uh-uh. that nigga strong <laughs> in his shape. Hey, what Yo, what? Hey, how you know this nigga? How long y'all know you each other? Bugging, dog. You like, a bugging. <laughs> yeah, I ain't gonna lie, man. I really, I don't be caring that much, man. Like, I really just, yeah. I be caring. I'm lying. I be caring. I just be too player to say something. Like, I ain't gonna say nothing. Yeah. I'm gonna let you dig your own hole. You feel me? The moment something happened. So, all right. So, is it is it the the is is it the the presence of the of the friendship, or is it like you've seen something, or like, or is it just like you don't feel like your girl should have male friends at all? Is that what you're no, saying? No, 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 no. She need to have male friends. She definitely needs to have male friends. Right. But there's a, there's, have- a, there's a boundary though. Like, just some shit. Like, you can't. Like, you have. Like, you have, like. If I'm out with my girl, you're not just speaking to her and not speaking to me. To me, cause that's oh, that's yeah, yeah, that definitely. is kind of wild. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, why you yeah, why yeah. you ain't say nothing? Oh, I, yeah. I, I, I don't know. You gotta ask him. Bet I'll be right yeah. back. Hold on, let me go ask yeah. this nigga. Yeah. yeah, yeah. If I'm dating Shorty, you need to be respecting me. Same way Just I'm respect. I had a situation happen that. like happened to me like that in Baltimore, right. where a nigga uh he had spoke to my girl, but he knew me, and like he ain't speak to me. I'm like, yo, what type time you on, bro? But then you you get you get deemed as the bad guy the moment you're approaching, cause me. I'm a pro. I'm gonna say something like, "Bro, you good? Like everything straight? Like what's up?" I'm saying something off rip. Yeah. Even if yeah, if you know me for sure. If you don't know me, you still should have the the common courtesy just, just speak, to say nigga. what up. You know what I mean? Just to say what right. up. And if you don't, then as like, my woman, what happened you need to, to the decency. Like me as a nigga, if I see a chick that I used to deal with or didn't used to deal with, and she with a nigga, even if I didn't used to deal with, her, I'm still speaking to the nigga regardless. I'm just like, yo, yeah. I might speak to him first. Okay. Like, what up, bro? I'm Jay. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Just, yeah. I don't just have some decency. Like, you niggas, that's how sure. niggas get their ass whooped. They don't have no, no respect. I feel like niggas never learn. Some some dudes never learn the rules to how to operate within social parameters and friendships. I'm not and going like, for that. I've had, I've, had, I've had motherfuckers be like, yo, uh, call my girl. And I'll be like, first of all, I don't got your girl phone number. Why, y'all? We hang out all the time because that's your girl. Like, I even have homegirls the way, like, we was hanging just as friends for years. And then, like, you might have started dating my best friend. Immediately, distance goes between us. Yes. Y'all, you don't call me like, you, nigga, because you fucking with my mans. I don't need no misconstruing, uh, wrong interpreting. And then from that point, look, when I want to talk to her, I'll call him. Hey, bro, ask, yeah. ask my mama. Like, I ain't about to be. Yeah. Like, but even when I was coming around Jay and Shade, like, niggas I, I'll be cordial, but niggas be horny. Niggas, niggas act like it ain't a million chicks out here. That's what I, that's what gets, that's what get on my nerves, bro. Like, you like you can't miss up on one chick, one piece of pussy, bro. Like, relax. You gotta, ch- like, there's no way in hell you trying to deal with a nigga girl, bro. No, no way. If I'm out, if I'm out and I and I run into a chick that I know and I'm with my girl, I'm immediately going to introduce them just so that way right. it's like, yeah, you know, well, this is yeah, so and so so so. Don't get so. no ideas. Don't right. get no ideas. None of that. Now, shit. what I, what I will say is where it get tricky is since we have this conversation. No, 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 not even that. Oh, that's not if tricky. You ain't, if that's, you ain't, that's... if you ain't as cool with a nigga, and he break up with his chick. That shit get crazy. Cause it's be like, oh, that shit do. They're like, that ain't even my man for real. Like, I don't got no love. To that. Nah, nah, I ain't, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I still wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that, bro. Unless I, unless I hate the nigga. Like, unless there's like a reason that I want to see that nigga die. What? Yeah, like I can't wait to spit on his grave or fuck? piss on his grave or something like that. Like, unless it gets to that point, I, I'm not going to do that, bro. I ain't going to cross sides like that. Even if we not cool like that. If I'm you just know the cross. nigga. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. We, I, I know you. I, I don't fuck with you that heavy. You know what I mean. But we ain't got no problems. Touche. Eh, you know, it ain't that serious. Nah, I'm pretty. Unless, <laughs> unless, unless Shorty pressing. If Shorty pressing, no, she I'm really trying no, to. I'm, I'm not saying. No. Yeah, I'm not saying like engaging in it. Like that's crazy. Yeah, yeah. I ain't. Oh, okay. But if you fall in my lap, I'm not going to throw it away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you fall in my, hey, come on now. Huh? You know what I'm saying? Keep it playing, man. You got to keep it playing in that situation. That's different. That's I remember different. it was a nigga. It was a nigga I used to work with. He tried to holler at my my chick, and 
I remember me and her was on a break one time. They went to the movies. They ended up like kissing. You know, when you get back with your chick, it's like a, what What did you do? Yeah, it's we like. We having the whole conversation. What, what, what you, you do? Nigga what you do? Shit. They said, no, we just kissed one time. I was like, oh, y'all kiss, right? But, and this nigga knew I was with her this and that third. So my payback was I, I ended up fucking his sister. Like, purposely. We ain't fucked his sister just cause type shit. Like, hey, nigga, we not, we not doing that. We not doing that. I would say his name. Just so he know, because I don't know if he know, but I, I think I want you to know. Grant, this was 10 years ago. I had another situation, nigga. Wait a minute. Uh, you said the sister and then, yeah. like, let the nigga know. And that's, that's nigga, this how, this that's how you know niggas. Life. And I got PTSD, I feel like, too, though. Because <sighs> niggas are, like you said, niggas are, are sneaky. Oh, my God. I was God. working out. I just moved to the A. I was working out with my shorty. And this one nigga who knew me walked up to me, was, like, complimenting me on my, my work, shit like that. Like I said, I'm a normally, oh, so-and-so, hey, this is my, my chick right here, la da 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 they meet. Me and her go to Miami. He ended up shooting her a DM like, yo, if you need some place to go while in Miami, um, let me know. I got some connects. And I'm looking at her like, well, that's weird. The nigga knew me, but why would he DM you about the shit? You know what I mean? Years later, these niggas done fucked around. And it was like the whole time, nigga, you was on some sneaky shit. The you know what I mean? Time, like, a the whole time. Nigga. Yo, you know what's so crazy? Now, Speaking of PTSD. This might sound crazy, but whatever. We amongst men. I feel like being an attractive male, having it your way, gives you anxiety and PTSD. This is why. Bro, be, when I was young, I used to be on the end of the... Yeah, pick up the phone. That's my boyfriend calling. Pick up the phone. You feel me? Like, you try... You wildin'. You feel me? Like, pick up the phone. She picking up the phone while she with a man. All right. Yeah, all right. You get older, you get the... Thinking about all this shit you done did. Now you got a girl and like, nah, no shit. I know shit. <laughs> yeah, because the shit you did. Bro, yeah. what? Like, yeah. it's, it's it's impossible to not think about that. Like, it's like, I can't even have a girl and just be in peace because like all the shit that I did is like, damn, I know I was wilding and beat. These girls got boyfriends. Even still to the, like, girls be having men and be like, they want this yeah. shit. And I'm like, that shit make me not want to have no girl at all. I've been, I've been fucking the chick while she was on the phone with her nigga. That's what I'm saying. That's, yeah. That's oh, what I'm yeah, talking yeah. about. I say, see oh, yeah. yeah. Pick, go ahead, pick oh, up the yeah. phone. Yeah. Pick up yeah. the phone. You trying to get her to hit, hit that right spot? She's like, I'm yeah. going to call you I, back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to call I'm busy. I'm a, that shit ain't yeah. funny no more. Cause you nah, that shit ain't like, funny at all. I don't even want to fuck no chick with no boyfriend now. And Yeah, hell no. Nah. And to be real, I'm going to keep it 100 with you, bro. I was talking about, I had this conversation not too long ago, right? about um, like being in an open relationship. And I'm like, yo, that shit sound good. But I think I seen a video and it, I think, uh, shout out to my guy Shabazz. It might've been Shabazz, I don't know, whatever. And it ain't about the open relationship between us two. It's about everybody else. Because now you start bringing people in your circle and they might have feelings that they can't, that, that, that they can't control, right? Mm -hmm. And that's how people get hurt. Cause at first I'm thinking about it like, we can have an open relationship, you know what I'm saying? Cause sometimes you might get, you know what I'm saying? You do your thing, I do my thing, whatever. It was a conversation. And then I thought about it like, yo, what happens if a nigga really, or a chick really like you, and she really, you could be honest with her, yo, I got a girl, you know what I'm saying? Like, we open, we doing our own thing. But you know how you tell, you know, back in the day, you used to tell girls we just friends, but your actions might not show just friends, right? And now she can't handle that. Man, that shit is tricky. I don't want, no, I don't want no chick that got a man. I can't do it. None of that. Stuff. Yeah, I can't do no open relationship. Cause if a nigga come through with that man, dingo, boy. <laughs> I ain't worried about that shit. What am I, nigga? First of all, you're not hey, even built like that. Man, I, what? You know what? You don't know how I'm built, nigga. Bro, you be wearing the little shorts, bro. I, bro, you don't be having no. Whoa. You don't be having no print Whoa. in the little shorts, bro. Whoa. Nah. Whoa. Right, Whoa. Right. He said thought, you be wearing the little shorts. Whoa. You're wearing the little shorts with no, with no print. So I know you're not built oh, like that, bro. Shit. Like, shit. Bitch, I wear compression shorts under my little shorts. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. I didn't know you was compressed over there. My bad. I know you was going to. Oh, you gotta extract bro, the files, man. This whole conversation is crazy. All right, I'm not uh, worried. Listen, I'm not worried about no other nigga because, bro, me. I mean, I get it in where I can fit in. You feel me? I might eat your pussy for an hour, for an hour long. So just so, just so I can make sure you. Fit in. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get the job done regardless. So, uh, hours. Hey, wow. you can say what you want. Yeah, he, Let that nigga he, do what he, he want. He, yeah. You get a smooth 20, 30 out of me at the max. All right. Uh, the worst is the one you fucking and she on a jail call with her nigga. Y'all got to stop Damn. fucking them ones. 
God yeah. damn. Yeah. Yo, why, you fucking it, why you fucking with a chick and her nigga in jail? What's he in jail for, though? That's important. He's trying to get, that, get, he's trying to get his head taken off for real. Yeah, yeah, nah. Yeah. If it's yo, some, if you it's some fucking, other shit. Yo, you hitting a chick while he in jail? That's, yo, he better have life. Because if that nigga get home, you know niggas be sensitive. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And then you and you he's, on the phone? Imagine you hit the right spot. Uh, and she really, uh. And she on the phone, he going to go crazy. But he ain't gonna be able to go crazy for another like two, three years, probably. So it's like, yeah, that right. nigga might. Like, like, niggas ain't got friends and family on the outside, bro. That shit can change. That shit could go left quick. I ain't, so, I, yeah, ain't getting, I, I ain't getting. I ain't gonna lie. If you in jail, right, and you can call yeah. somebody to run down on the nigga that's spanking your chick, that nigga need to be uh in a mental uh, asylum for real. Because think of you know how crazy that is. You running down on a nigga for his chick getting spanked and because he inj- that don't even make sense. Yeah, that, that's wild. That's 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 supposed to be your property, right? And so like you don't want nobody smashing on your property. But no, Same I'm saying the nigga that's going to no. I understand you getting in your emotions, right? I understand that. But I'm saying yeah. for another nigga to run down for you is type crazy. Like that's just yeah. insane. Yeah. But that's your that's your man's though. Like if that's if that's somebody you. You know I'm not, I mean? Bro, that's if you don't take that L, nigga, you locked up. What you thought she was gonna be? So, so JS, when I'm in jail and I find out that yeah. somebody smashing my shorty, I'll call you and tell yeah. you, hey, go over there and go beat that nigga ass, man. Go, 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 kill oh, that I nigga. Gotta, so I don't have to kill him. I just gotta whip his ass. Yeah, oh, yeah that's beat, easy. Yeah. That's easy. Yeah. Why would what? you yeah. do that? That's retarded. It don't First make no sense. sense. I'm a naturally violent person. I don't really get an opportunity to fucking get stress out that often. I don't like niggas in the first place. And then you, my mans, and like my assumption is it's blood in, blood out of this bitch. So like if I get in a situation, you better be able to stab a nigga up or beat a nigga ass too. So like, yo, that's gang and gang out. Like it is what it is, bro. Like I mean, well, you don't, you you really telling me that you wouldn't hold it down for no, one of your homies? Like not for my best of not, best friends. No. Not, if, not my not mother, if my mother called me and say, no, not even for, no, 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 it makes no, no sense. Don't say nothing. Let me tell you something. I am a violent person, bro. Don't say nothing to my mama, my cousin, my daddy, my, yo, you, I, I will we murder saying, a nigga. We, yeah, that's that. we say, that's I'm saying that's you. I'm saying if my me. man's call me, my best friend, let's say Nick call me. Yeah. Knock on wood. Yeah. yeah. Yo. Nigga, well, I can't use Nick because he actually got girl. I don't know. Let's say my man, my best friend called me like, yo, nigga, knocking down my chick. I'm booked, bro. Go get, first of all, you need to be calling a chick to knock her ass out. Not me to knock the nigga out. He being a nigga. <laughs> Second of all, my nigga, you booked. What you think she was going to do? You shouldn't have got locked right. up. I love right. you, brother, but that ain't my fight to fight. Not this one. Now, if somebody <laughs> was putting somebody in danger, that's different. But for your chick getting knocked, man, you is you is retarded, boy. And don't, and don't go, don't go over there trying to fight. And end up getting popped. <laughs> it happens. Yes. But uh, pause. Let's pause that. So, uh, yo, that was wild. Let, let's let's <laughs> right. No, nigga, you wild. Uh, let's clarify something. If I'm in that space in my life and and we pulling off activities like that, you are applying way too much logic to niggas that's that dumb. Like, so like it is what it is. The game is the game. But at the same time, you also got to remember that uh, there are people in this world that take their relationships dead ass serious. Because in a lot of places, those friendships and relationships are all they got. Niggas ain't got a car. Niggas ain't got a house. Niggas ain't got future. Niggas ain't got no savings. But guess what? They got their homie. And that's and that, that connection is there because when niggas didn't have nothing, niggas was breaking off half the chicken wing. Or, you know what I mean? You ain't have a place to stay. Niggas was like allowing you to kick in any crib. Yo, but that, there are yo you, could be, you could house me while I'm homeless, don't have nothing to eat. If you call me and you locked up and you say a nigga knocking down my chick, can you go beat him up? I'm sorry, bro. The answer is no. I'm sorry. Not no nigga, logic. You could have gave me clothes when I have nothing. I'm not going to there beat is. a nigga up because he's piping your chick and you locked up. There is no logic assigned to loyalty sometimes. Like blind. That, that's that, you understand the term blind loyalty. If a nigga call you and tell you it's action time, it's action time. Ooh. I've had look. I've had niggas say some wild shit about me on Twitter. And I had phone calls of niggas going, I'm going to whack this nigga right now over a Twitter post, bro. Blind loyalty is blind loyalty. My bad. Yeah, you it's, really live a different life. I ain't never know like you to be in a mob or nothing like that. Like what the- I'm not 
I am. Let you us had clarify. a nigga about to whack a nigga because of a tweet. Like you different, bro. I don't think oh, I can get a nigga whack. I don't think I can get. I don't think I can get on the phone and get a nigga to whack a nigga with a tweet. Let's, hey. let's pause. <laughs> let's pause. Let's pause everything this nigga said. First of all, let's pause that whole I, everything. I wish a nigga would come whack me. <laughs> <laughs> I've been waiting to get whacked. Yo, you were gay. <laughs> hey. Yeah. I'm not. You're gay. I have a girl. Oh yeah, you're, 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 you have a girl to mask your gayness. That's my, that's my beard. That's my cover up. That's, that's, what, that's, what, that's, what, that's what niggas would say. You have a girl to, to mask the fact, to hide the fact that you're gay. You don't want people to know. Uh, that's crazy. Niggas are crazy, bro. Uh, you guys are bugging, bugging, bro. I don't niggas say, I got a girl. Understand. You're gay. I said, I, I, I wish the nigga would come whack me. That's not gay. <laughs> I don't think a nigga got it in him to come do that. Um, um, yo, stop. <laughs> if a nigga, he probably got it in him, all right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, pause, man. You making Jay, you making Jay uncomfortable. <laughs> I've been uncomfortable, nigga. Nah, all right, let, let's, can we, can we please? Yeah, nigga said, I don't think the nigga got it in him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he got hey, it in him. Hey, hey, whatever you radio rock, radio world right, right, nigga. Don't be calling us gay, nigga. You gay, uh, nigga. Like you be sucking dicks as ass. Wait, what's what the f- wait? Whoa, 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 time out. Yeah. How do you know that? What's going? Pause. We- this is just said that y'all gay. Right, let's go to uh, just, just, just look. She just put everybody in it. She said y'all all gay. Ain't nobody tell you to say that in the chat. You all all gay. <laughs> different. That's not even the correct grammar. <laughs> <laughs> y'all. How you use all guys? <laughs> Y'all, 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 you can't say a fucking word. Well, except for J.O. He'll knock that nigga out. But if you if you not, you know, it's a problem. 